If I had to do it again, and this is the question I've asked myself almost every single day, I'd have to say yes. I do battle with it. I really have cried a lot and I've put a lot of work into this program and I'm very proud of what I've accomplished and I would do it a hundred times over. I mean, I just shaved off two years of my next program and, you know, I've made my family proud and my friends are proud of me and I feel better as a person because of Pond here, so I would do it over again a hundred times. I'm very proud. I think it'd be my mom. In the middle of COVID, she decided to homeschool my siblings. So she's homeschooling a seven-year-old and a nine-year-old, and she's also handling my two-year-old brother and my three-month-old brother. So she's a very big inspiration. She's, um, she's my light, and I look at her whenever I need help, and I, I would never think of anyone else as my inspiration. I think she is my top, my top role model, and she's amazing. I did a lot of college and high school courses online at the same time during COVID. So I had chemistry and then I had psychology and biology and it was like, oh gosh, you know, I'm taking an honors course and then I'm taking two college courses and it was very difficult, but overall it's earned me some scholarships and I've done great on my SATs and ACTs and I don't think that if I didn't have this experience, I wouldn't be where I am. I wouldn't have had so many scholarship opportunities and I probably wouldn't have even applied to Harvard or Dartmouth, which I got into Dartmouth, by the way. <laughs> so that's one thing I'm looking forward to. So the ride was very difficult, but I'm, I'm proud to say that I finished it and I'm really, really happy to graduate. <laughs> so my next step is I am going to be attending a university for my bachelor's degree, but I do want to be a surgeon eventually. So I will get my bachelor's in nursing and then I will go to get my master's and my PhD and hopefully just go from there. I mean, I'm just gonna take it one step at a time and hopefully I reach my dreams.